President Donald Trump was impeached by the House but not convicted by the Senate. This acquittal has made history and given politicians much to talk about, even locally here in Waco. The House part of the process was an unfortunate hyperpartisan sham that was not based on any uh, proper investigation. It was just designed from the beginning to try to overturn the 2016 election. With, oh, look, I have some impeachments. I almost feel like I owe Richard Nixon an apology. There's a lot of parallels between the Nixon administration and the Trump administration. But what we thought back in my day as being really sort of scandalous and really pushing the edge of the envelope kind of behavior uh, appears to be nothing compared to what happens now. Donald Trump is the third U.S. president in U.S. history to be impeached. What do Baylor students have to say about it? Honestly, I really think that um, when Nancy Pelosi tore up Donald Trump's speech at the State of the Union, it just showed this great division in our country right now and also just this anger that we all have. You know, as a blanket statement, no matter how you feel about President Trump, his policies or even how he conducts himself, that the process as it was going through the House was a total farce. I think that it's been like a big waste of time for this country. I mean, there's a lot more pressing matters. For Lariat TV News, I'm Sarah Gill.